everybody, this is Nolan here, and welcome to another episode of V3, and welcome aboard my <laughs> freaking ARC! My big cat! And welcome to another episode of Dankenrompa V3. Why did I say that twice? I don't know. Okay, you got- Give me my pen. Give me my pen. Give me Wait, that was your pen. pen? Oh, sorry, I didn't realize I took yours. Where's my cap? Where's my cap? Why okay. did you steal okay. my Okay, go pen? ahead. Okay, wait. Yeah, go ahead. Ask. Are we heading to the library today? Yes. I'll tell you everything there. Oh, okay. Great. Okay, so, yeah, this episode we're heading to the library, guys. Okay, so... Uh, the library. To the left, to the, the right, left, to, to the, the right, to, to the, the right, straight, to the straight. Oh. Wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. This is Nolan's playthrough. To the right, to the straight, to the straight, to the straight, to the straight. Oh, Andy, hi. Ugh. Wait, why did you just look down there, Nolan? What the heck? What's up, Kaede, Shuichi? Are you guys gonna wanna pray to Atua? Mm. If you pray, he will come floating down to carry you away in two days' time. Yeah, well, I don't plan on dying in two days. I'm gonna get everyone out of here. You're right. I feel the same way. There might be something we can do. Why, that's all the more reason to pray. Huh? What? If you pray, Atua will watch over you both while you work hard. Mm. 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 That's okay. I just don't feel like it at the moment. Hmm, I see. How do you Let me know. Let me know when you want to pray. Bayonara. Is that what she says all the time? That's what she says. Bayonara. She can't rely on a higher, higher, higher power right now. Our only choice is to figure this out ourselves. Bayonara. Weird ghost. Sayonara, suckers. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. To the straight, to the straight, to the down I wish I could actually just walk downstairs instead of having to load. I just want to walk down the stairs for once. In a dank and romp a game, can they make that happen? <laughs> can can the developers make that happen? To you know, walk up and down stairs, actually, without it loading. I like to Wait, walk no up way. and down stairs. Okay, I get it. All right. There's an entrance to the library right there. Sh no, you don't have to go down that way. <laughs> okay. I'll head through. Wait, what's this? It's it's somebody gets through. The... What was I saying? Be guest. Be our 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 guest. <laughs> okay, let's pit everything. No! Hey! Alright, I'll explain everything. First, take a look at the card reader. As Shuichi said that, he moved the bookcase to reveal the hidden door. Ramble ramble. Ramble, 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 ramble. Somebody used it. I peeked into the gap of the card. Uh, the dust is gone. I'm... That's right. I checked it right after nighttime started yesterday, and the dust was there. But this morning, it was gone. So that means someone entered this door during nighttime. No, I checked it during nighttime. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was me thinking. This may sound far fetched, but perhaps Monokuma's revival is related to this door somehow. Huh? How so? If I remember correctly. Remember what the Monocub said? Oh god, yes. Flashback time. This school has some machine somewhere that can make a whole lot of pops. Pops. Just activate that machine and you can have any spare pop as many spare pops as you want. So what you're saying is Um so there's a machine that can build spare monocumas? No, wait, what he's saying is that uh, there are monocumas inside the door, basically. A bunch of them. Because uh, that would explain why we saw Monokuma alive and well in the morning. At nighttime, some someone went through the door and activated the machine. And then there's Monokuma just- and then there's what Monokuma just told us. It's definitely the mastermind who did it, but I have the no idea. The time limit is now in effect. If a murder does not occur by nighttime two days from now, then every student forced to participate in this killing game will die! I knew. The way he phrased it seemed peculiar. Why not just say everyone will die? We went through. We went out of his. He went out of his way to specify that students forced to participate will die. Huh? But why? Unresponsive controls. That's true. My deduction is that one of the volunteer participate and wasn't forced. That would mean that they would avoid execution without breaking any rules. 
Perhaps that's why Monokuma said it in that way. And that person is the one in our group who's con cooperating with Monokuma? I don't know if Monokuma is that strict with the rules, but if he's trying to protect someone, that would imply that they're doing more than just cooperating with Monokuma. Huh? What? Because I believe that if one of us can create a spare <clears throat> one of us can create spare Monokumas, they are the mastermind of the killing game. Um, so wow. the person who's responsible for all of our suffering is one of us? Uh, oh crap, okay. of course. This is just what I, what I've deduced, but it's entirely possible. Uh, that's why I only I didn't want to think about it in front of everyone. Think about it. If we don't if we told them now, they might all try to find the mastermind and be led to murder. I'm that's why I can only tell you, Kaede. Oh, interesting. He just trusts her. The just because. The one controlling Monokuma. I can't believe that person is responsible for all the suffering. Why are they talking about this right at the beginning? Could be among us. It's hard to accept, but if it's true, I can't forgive them. Hey. So, what do you plan to do now, Shuichi? We're gonna find this mastermind, right? I'm... I'm thinking of taking the risk just before some ex expi time expires. I believe the mastermind will come here just before time is up, and I can expose them. Okay. Wait, how do you know they'll come here right before time's up? That's... I'm extrapolating uh, from something Monokuma told us earlier. Mold to shreds by countless Monokumas! From the rumored Monokuma making... To produce a large number of Monokumas, the mastermind would have to come here. They would have to get into the hidden room to activate the machine. Of course, none of this is certain. There's a chance the mastermind won't show. Like I said, it's a risk. But I'm willing to take it. It's better than just sitting around waiting to die. Yeah. I'll take that risk with you. Ah, but Kaede, this is just my deduction. It's possible that I'm wrong. Of course. Yeah, I know, but I've made up my mind. You told me about this, so that must mean you trust me, right, Shibichi? Yeah. Then I'll trust you, too. Aw. You know? I mean, oh, Jesus. I don't have any good ideas. Of, I don't have any a good idea of my own, so I'll obviously help with yours. Mm -hmm. Okay, then. Let's expose the mastermind together, Shibichi. Thank you. Thank you, Kaede. You have a way of encouraging me. I never expected this to happen. I can't believe our enemy is within the group, hiding in plain sight. Okay. Yeah. Now that we know this, I should stop saying everyone needs to work together. All oh, right. Whoever the mastermind is will expose them and help everyone escape. Oh, we have. Okay, the light. Sorry. Sorry. And when all of this is behind us, we're gonna stay good friends. That's a promise, okay? Uh, okay. Right. Wrong. No, that's wrong. No, that's wrong. After we reapplied the dust to the card reader, I left Shuichi and returned to my room. Yay! Who are we hanging out for free time? Oh, it is free time already? I believe so. Okay. That time already? Two days from now, at the stroke of night time. That's when the time limit expires. Until then, I guess I'll check on the others. I'm a little worried about them. <laughs> <laughs> who are we hanging Wait, out with? don't we need to know what presents to give who? The mono mono machine in this game is by the warehouse. It's the door right next to the warehouse. Okay. Well, at the academy, if you have free time now, every now and then, during free time, you can spend time with other students to strengthen your bond with them. You can also give them a present to strengthen these bonds further. You can buy presents at the school store or win them at Mono Mono Machine. If your bonds get strong, get strong enough, an intimate event might occur. Nice. But if you don't have free time forever, spending time with someone passes time. You can also end free time by going straight to bed. Uh, by yourself, that is. I mean, I wouldn't skip it, but if you'd rather be alone, that's cool too. Oof. Okay, first let's get some monocones. There we go. Okay, so... We're gonna talk to Rantaro. I'm worried about you, Kaede. You've been working so hard trying to help us. I think you've earned a little break. Should I spend time with Rantaro? Then let's take a break together. Ah, Rantaro. Yeah, whatever. I'm just a guy who's kind of weird. 
I, sp I spent some time looking at the fountain with Yutaro. Looking at what fountain? Rantaro and I grew a little closer today. Oh gosh. Would you like his to give fountain? Rantaro a present? His fountain? His fountain. Uh, Shut up. Stop. That, yes. What does Okay, he like? so what do we got? 18. Okay. I probably have that, considering I have like half of the freaking items. No, you don't. Yeah, 53% rate. No, but that's... That's what it means, isn't no, it? No, there's a lot more items than just that, you know. That's not 18, where are you going? Oh, wait, wait, wait they don't have high. they don't have numbers? <laughs> no, 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 they don't have numbers on them? Eight. Number. Oh, I didn't see, okay. You don't no. Have 30. How was I sp- Ooh. Yeah. You've gotten something pretty interesting. Where did you find it? Oh, you're giving it to me. Does he like it or love a it? present? He just likes it. Ah. I'll always list off the ones they love first. That's so sweet. You're being so nice to a guy that doesn't even remember his own talent. Hey. Kaden, would you like to have some tea and chat for a bit? Is he drink tea? Okay. You just gave you him just Boba gave tea. You just gave him tea. <laughs> Wait, that was tea? And here I am, sitting across from Rantaro, drinking tea with him. I wonder. Hey. <laughs> I'm so tired today. Hey, are you hitting on me? <laughs> no, I'm not trying to hit on you. I guess people assume I'm a sleazy guy because of the way I look, but I'm not. Besides, would you like to have some tea? What kind of old school pickup line is that? You think so? Hmm, but maybe it's so old school that it's looped around and become cool again. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Although, it is true that I wanted to spend some time with you. I'm surrounded by strong personalities. I like him, but it's a tad bit overwhelming to me. Yeah, a lot of the Ultimate students here are pretty unique. Oh, but I think Shuichi is pretty normal. Now that's true, but he's a detective. Could he be hiding his real personality, you know? You could say the same about yourself. I understand. But he's reliable in tough situations. That's not so bad, is it? That's right. True, but the sort of situation where you might need a reliable detective would be... Would be... No, it's not. By the way, who's the most unique person here in your eyes? Oof. <laughs> Me, without a doubt. <laughs> no. Well, maybe, yeah. You're just gonna oh, this is tough. all my characters that All I of these guys are like... That's tough. I mean, Kibo's... Kibo's literally not human, so... That, uh, yeah, okay. That's robophobic. <laughs> That's, yeah. But everybody, all of these guys are really weird, but Miu probably the least amount. She's just stupid. Uh, Kyo, great. <laughs> great. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, Kyo is- Kyo's just kind of creepy. Okay, fine. I guess looks blatantly unique is Kibo. Kibo. Being a robot is interesting enough that his personality <laughs> really matters. Wow. But, you know, I think Kibo's on our side. Huh? What do you mean on our side? Yeah. Have you ever heard of the three laws of robotics? The long and short of it is, robots can't harm people. If Kibo's creator was a good scientist, he would have programmed that into Kibo's AI. We're all humans, so we can assume that he's on our side. Actually, of course, I'm just guessing. You know? You seem pretty composed, Rantar. Where did that come from? Because... From how you observe everyone and make rational judgments about their personalities. Maybe he's the ultimate observer. You think so? Yeah, how do I put this? It's like he's already used to this kind of situation. But that's a weird way to put it. There's no way he could be used to any of this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I guess I feel more relaxed around here. I almost feel normal. Oh, no. oh but don't misunderstand. I mean normal in a good way. <laughs> Sorry, I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> I'm a friendship fragment! Alright. <gasps> I did it, guys. I became the true, the ultimate friend. I spent some time drinking tea with Rantaro. Wow. <laughs> Let me just... Sus. Sus. I did not spill water on myself. Sus. I did not. I did not heat her. I did not. It's baloney. Oh, hi, Mar. Bruh. 
I still have some time before it's night time. Yeah, you can read from there. <laughs> what should I do? I don't want to just sit around and do nothing. More free time. Yay! <laughs> Alright. Okay, wait, I need to do the rest. You guys decide. Yeah, I'll do Maki. Yeah. Yeah, Maki seems cool. I don't know. She's... She's forgettable, in my opinion. I don't know. Probably not, but... Go find her on the map. I was. Let us talk to... Oh. Ju. Jeez. It feels like we were just given our ultimate talent. Where did he win. freaking go? <laughs> what the fr... Ethan! <laughs> Give me a minute. I'm gonna go scold him. No! <laughs> You're not! Okay. Guys, I'm getting chewed out. You're getting what? Chewed out? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Let's go. Let's do this. And now we've been in this lousy situation. Being an ultimate sucks. Should I spend time with Should Frank? I send... Should I spend time with Maki? I don't know why I'm complaining to you. You're stuck here too. No. <laughs> and if there's time to ex complain, I'd rather spend it being productive. You think so? I think so. <laughs> God, you have ADHD with that. <laughs> Shut up. I, I have ADD, <laughs> thank you very much. I spent some time searching around the school for clues with Maki. 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 Maki and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Maki a present? Yes. Uh, 91. Yay! Ooh. Ooh. She don't like it. She's like, Ooh, thank you! This is, oh. This is for me? What is it? Uh, do I look mad? I may not show it, but I'm actually pretty happy. Hey. You're the ultimate child caregiver, aren't you, Maki? What are you talking about? Yeah. What of it? You know? No, nothing. I just thought you'd be more worried about the kids. The chillins. Kids? <laughs> I see. Oh, you mean the kids at the orphanage? Yeah. Yeah, will they be okay without their caregivers? So what? They'll be fine. Even if I'm not around, those kids should know how to take care of themselves. Mm, really? That's true. At least where I grew up, we had to learn how to take care of ourselves. Of course, the older children care for the younger ones until they're old enough. There are several older, old, 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 <laughs> there are several <laughs> other older kids there. Did you just so they have five, Maki? But I'm sure you're like a big sister to those kids. They must miss you terribly. Like I, I wonder about that. Honestly, do I don't know why kids are so attached huh? to me. Hmm. Because you're their mom? They probably- No, that's Karumi. <laughs> they probably just want someone to spoil them. Doesn't necessarily have to be me. Don't say that. Shuichi also mentioned that he couldn't see Maki as the ultimate child caregiver. Oh, maybe she doesn't want- People will find out she's worried. Maki does seem pretty reserved. What is it? Is that all? You just wanted to ask me that? Stop! <laughs> no way! What? Um, no. Uh, well, I, I don't also know why you get so mad about what that. child caregivers usually do. What they usually do? Yeah, do. Stop! <laughs> no way! What? Why are you. Stuff. I play with the kids and make sure they don't do anything stupid. <laughs> I'm gonna do it! No. <laughs> When it's time for their afternoon nap, I see them lullabies or even books. Oh! 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 Hmm, that is pretty normal. Dylan just shows no emotion. Stupid clicking. Okay. What did you expect? You know? Like some sort of super duper high school level ultimate child care technique? This is stupid. That's stupid. Nothing like that exists. You think so? Think so? <laughs> Then it has to be love. <laughs> Your deep love is the reason why they like you so much. I told you. What does that mean to you? What does love mean to you? Oh, I can't right click. <laughs> Don't hesitate. It's all about having a benevolent heart. You have to love children. Yeah, probably. That's right. You have to love children. Not in that way. Is that what you're into? <laughs> One round move from the police will be all over. <laughs> no, not that. Kids are just an example. Right? But it's the thought of cherishing, sh cherishing someone, sh cherishing someone other than yourself. You know. The kids probably felt your love, Maki. I'm right already. Is that all? Then I'm going. Oof. Bruh. Oh. Huh? 
Bye bye. Huh? Maki! She left. I felt like she was annoyed. Or was she just being shy? Yay! Yay! We just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. Why do we do that? <laughs> okay. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> freaking After parting ways with Maki, who left in a huff, I returned to my room. Maybe we shouldn't have made you main character. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Is it time for another free time event? No. No, you gotta sleep first. And, yeah. Ding dong, bing bong. Yeah, bing bong, bing ding dong. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> this is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy. <laughs> He's literally Winnie the Pooh, except not. Drunk. Yeah. As you can see, Mono Kid is a little too much honey. She was really, really happy about Daddy's return. <laughs> now let's play darts. Mono Dam can be the dartboard. And let's get bowling. Mono Dam can get be the ball. Yeah, wow. By the way, which announcement were we making? The nighttime announcement. That was already. It was already. What? It's already that late? Then we should go to bed soon. Bedtime or sign? Wow. It's already nighttime. At this rate, the time limit will expire before we know it. Oh no! But I won't lose. I won't give up. Because I want to see everyone's smiles just a little longer. I want to spend time with them, laughing and talking like normal teenagers. So, I won't give up. Oof. One more day. Until the first kill. I'll teach you guys how to win over a lady. Shuichi, listen up. First, you gotta give her a present. Ladies can't resist <gasps> presents. Wait, yeah. Celeste. Celestia. Oh, wait, the, what the, the heck? Bottle, the Monokuma's in the bottle. <gasps> From oh, what? <gasps> I didn't even see this. <laughs> wait a minute. What is this? My Celestia. But you can't give her any present. It's gotta be a present suited to her tastes. And it's gotta be a handmade present too, so it looks like you put thought into it. For example, the kind of lady who's into strong men would love a handmade pro wrestling group. She'll love being surrounded by macho dudes, and you'll make money off of the wrestlers too. If enough wrestlers get popular, then it might be good to host a big event. And after they're done beating up uh, each other, uh, the, the words, English, I can't speak, I can't handle doing this anymore. They can fight each other over pro wrestling groups. Sorry about that, I just have crises from time to time. You know, I'm middle aged at this point. Just give it a shot, and I'm positive you'll win her heart. He's going through a midlife crisis. Shuichi just shows up at Kaede's doorstep with Gonta and Kaito. <laughs> like, hey, I got a pro wrestling group right here. <laughs> 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 what Rise the? and Shiner sign. Look at it, it's just dead. This is an announcement. This is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy. It's 8 a.m. Time to wake up. Let's have a wonderful killing school semester today. Why do I sound? I literally sound like the Monokuma from the anime. Z Jeez, Mono Kid really drank too much honey. How long is he gonna keep sleeping? Oh, by the way, Father's time limit expires at 10 p.m. tomorrow night. Oof. Oof. Time limit expires tomorrow night. Shuichi is gambling like Celestia on that. <laughs> Which means we have to watch the library while time is running out. Shouldn't we start preparing then? I'm getting worried. Uh, oh, Shuichi! Perfect timing! Opens the door, it's not Shuichi, I don't think. Hold on. That's everything. Shuichi, I wanted to ask you something. Uh huh. But as soon as I answer the door. Wait, you already know who it is? I think it might be. Oh. No, never mind. Too bad! It's me! <laughs> God damn it. Ah! <laughs> Kaito Aww. Momota. It hurts my heart to be screamed at by a young girl. <laughs> Jesus. But it hurts so good all the same! Jeez. 
I, first of all, I don't know how I even did that. <laughs> Second of all, what, well, what do you want? Ah, hey, um, uh, I figured I'd come let you know that some of the research labs are open. Huh? You mean the ultimate research labs? Those classrooms tailored to our 16 talents? Enough about ultimate. <laughs> It's just uh -huh. a research lab. Your lab is finally all set up, so you can go in whenever you want. Now, go to the ultimate pianist's lab. Penis. Right away penis. And compose a murderous <laughs> melody, Pingus. A murderous melody? What are you even talking about? So, um, are you gonna invite me inside for tea or what? You're not Rantaro, go away! Where's no? Oh, okay, <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> I, I no, just, of course not. I just have to, like, whatever I land on, I just click on it. Huh? I slam the door in Monokuma's face with all my mind. I can imagine that. <laughs> Jeez, that was super annoying. He's just so, like, small. And he's <laughs> like, <know>. Katie! <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Oh, God. God, how annoying. Did he, it's not him. It's definitely somebody else. Jeez, enough already. You're bothering me. <laughs> oh god, how did he get- okay. Oh, I'm sorry, should I come back later? No, oh, Shuichi, sorry, just ignore what I said. I wanted to talk to you, sh talk to you too, Shuichi. I was wondering if you needed anything for the plan. Uh, um... Well, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. I might not know how to keep watch of the library, huh? on the library. Weren't we planning on hiding inside the library and keeping watch from there? Hmm. If we do that, we risk the mastermind running into us. It's safer to watch from further away. We also need hard evidence to convince everyone in the Mastermind's identity. So that's why I thought it might be a good idea to set up cameras. Cameras? That's not a good idea. I, I, you know what? Obviously, they're gonna find out. They're so dumb. Okay. I found some cameras and security sensors in the warehouse with some modification. We could combine the two, and we and have cameras that will detect movement and, and have take pictures. If we set up a few in the library, we can capture proof of the Mastermind. And we don't have to be in the library for this to work, so we are less likely to get caught. That's a really good idea. But do you know how to modify a camera? That's... Uh, well, I don't know how. That's why I wanted to ask Miu. The ugh, the ultimate inventor, could help us. Mm -hmm. Pfft, yeah. Oh, yeah that's like, she's true. gonna do anything. But... but she's pretty intimidating, so I'm having trouble talking to her by myself. She's not intimidating if you're just like, hey, shut up. <laughs> that's right. Oh. In that case, we should ask her together. I saw Miu heading to the dining hall. I think she's just she'll be in there. Ah, but we should be careful about what we tell her. She might be it. Oh no! Don't tag you're it. It. <laughs> it. I'm gonna do it to you. No, remember that. She might be it. As in, Miu might be the mastermind. Hmm, I doubt it, but. Well, if that's what well, you think. Well, actually, no. It would make sense. She's the she's the ultimate inventor. Bum, bum, I don't know. Bum, 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 she would build Monoquema. Uh, oh, it always feels like when outside. I leave. No, oh, wait, oh, there is. Stop. Talk to them. If you see some new, He's so short. Oh my god. <laughs> Morning, Ryoma. Oh, it's you and Suichi too, huh? You guys are always together. What? We're not always <clears throat> together. Hmm. Well, not always, but I feel like whenever I see one of you, the other's nearby. I is that right? Well, it's not a bad thing. You can't protect yourself when you're alone. Huh? Be careful. I thought something would happen at night, when it's easiest to get someone else. But everyone's safe and nothing all that bad has happened. Of course not. No one would do that. No one would do that. <laughs> I said it before, but... If you really want to live through a situation like this, grumbling won't help. What? <clears throat> I understand what you want to believe in everyone, but... Idealistic thoughts like that won't save everyone. You might end up losing what you tried to save. Huh? Including your mouse movement. <laughs> yeah. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Let that sink in. <laughs> Who knows? I've talked too much. He's creepy, kind of. No, anyway. He's you cool. Can... No, the way he his like expression sometimes, he's like his eyes are like super big. Okay. Anyway, you think I've only had a little bit of time left to think? That's the situation. The best thing to do is live life with confidence. That's all I can say. <laughs> Let's see, look at him. He's creepy. No. He's look at him. He's just baby, man. He's just baby. He's so freaking tiny. And he's got a shackle on his leg. I didn't actually know that. Yeah. Was there. <laughs> That's cool. Nobody. Okay. Now it's time to go talk. No, there's still more people. I know. If you see some oh my talk god. To her. 
Okay. Hey. Good morning. Yeah. Wait. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> sorry. I don't know what happened to my Christ. <laughs> Good morning. Ugh, yeah. That's my new. <laughs> morning, Rantaro. Good morning, Rantaro. Uh, actually, may I ask What's you a question? Huh? What's up? Being questioned by the ultimate detective is making me kind of nervous, especially with my voice. No, well, it's not. It's nothing bad. <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing. What's up, Chuichi? Hey! I wanted to know what you meant by the ultimate hunt. Oh yeah, I wanted to know about that, too. <laughs> I told you, it's nothing. Just forget about but, it. But... Look, I told you, like I told you before, I was just a little confused. Not being able to remember my own talents is stressing me out. Mind. Really, I'd appreciate it if you didn't ask me about it anymore. Sorry. I understand. Sorry if it seemed like I was interrogating sorry. you. No, no. That's what a detective does. I'm sorry that I'm not much help. Isn't that what a detective does? Well, then, I'll see you later. He the just disappeared! He faded out of existence. <laughs> hey, Shuichi, do you think Rantaro really is just confused? I don't know, but he certainly does want to talk about it. Doesn't want to talk about it. He certainly does want to talk about it. Doesn't want to I shouldn't ask him any more questions. Yeah, we should be focusing on exposing the mastermind. Oh! Okay, look behind you. Oh. Wait, look, okay. Go behind you. Go to the yellow dots. Okay. No, the, the one. Yes. Okay. Yeah, one. Man, straight shot. It's just a straight shot. Kibo! Hey, how many? I'm on level 16 already. That's interesting. Morning, Kibo. Yeah. Why'd you knock on my chair? Ah, good morning. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Your timing is impeccable. I have something to. I have something I wish to ask you both. Huh? What is it, Kiba? Well, what are your thoughts on this door? No matter how hard I try, it will not open. <laughs> um, well, it doesn't seem like an exit. That's right. What do you think is on the other side of this wall? Hey! Oh! <laughs> Out of nowhere? Okay. <laughs> Why don't you just fly over and see for yourself? Huh? <clears throat> Whoa! K K Kokichi! <laughs> Come on, I want to see you fly! Wanna fly? I knew you were gonna say that. Wanna fly? <laughs> you don't know, you don't get, don't get it. <laughs> Forget it. <laughs> Robots have jetpacks or whatever under their feet, right? Uh, what? You don't? No, I don't. Have a dick? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? Right? Oh yeah, if you had a jetpack, then you... <laughs> then you could have stuck this Nobody's foam on the wall better than I did. Oh. Then you could have flown over the wall and called for help. Oh, Jeez, you're such a huge disappointment, Kibo. Mm. Wow. Oh, <laughs> oh God. Just like, <laughs> 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 Kibo? Unfortunately, I'm fine. Just let it be. He actually has feelings. I don't like sci-fi functions like flight. But aren't you already pretty sci-fi? Oof. Okay, go look for Samugi. Like, don't even go in the cafeteria yet. Because... Okay. Where's Samugi, then? Inside the school. Oh. I'm slowly getting there in terms of my way around, but you guys gotta get- You guys were supposed to cut me some slack there a bit, but it's I'm fine. gonna cut your slack off in a second. Alright, I guess I have to talk to this badass. I don't know. Morning, Gyo. Good morning, Suichi. I mean, Kai Really? Shuichi. You don't say my name first? That's in the script, Gyo! Have you come for breakfast? If so, Kurumi said she would make everything if you ask, so why not just do that? Hmm? But I'd feel bad if I made her serve. Where is Teru Teru? We need the bre he's dead. The, the good breakfast. <laughs> no, he's not. Okay, well, he's not in this. <laughs> oh, okay. I had the same thought, so I declined. But it seemed to only make her more restless. If I left on- if- if left on her own, I'm guessing she would prepare enough food for everyone regardless. I see. <clears throat> Kirumi really likes taking care of people. Because she's best girl! <laughs> it's- it's not something you can describe in such simple language. Her devotion to her duties as maid is extremely impressive. Despite knowing her end may come tomorrow, she just does not- uh, she just does- she just does not- she does not so much as flinch! This too is beautiful. Rationality, poise, even in the face of certain looming death. Ki 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 
is exactly, it is exactly as I surmise. I can bear witness to the beauty in, of humanity here. <laughs> kick, 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 kick. Um, uh, uh, don't steal my line. I don't care if I don't see it. <laughs> I don't care. No, no. squats way. and farts. Why do you keep going, not going that way? You need to go down the hallway. <laughs> Look at that! Woo! Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I Sony? guess the movie's not here. Uh, I guess it's tomorrow, though. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Morning, Maki. Morning. Are you implying that she kills? Um, no. Is she in a bad mood? Head into the dining hall. You guys better brace yourselves, son. Why? Wh wh what? Why? Because Mew's there. Huh? Mew? She's always weird, but this morning she's been even weirder than Yay. usual. Yay! Since her research lab opened, she's been pretty excited to tinker with her machines. Hmm, I can totally see Mew bragging to Maki about that. I see. I see, so Mew's lab is open too. Monokumi, to Monokumi, told, Monokumi. Me this, <laughs> told me this morning that mine was open. And what about you? I'm... No, not yet. I suppose only Mew and Kaede's labs have been prepared. So. I see. So I'm not that important. Uh, I wish my phone wasn't just bad. Yeah, yeah. Bad. Is it slow? It's just awful. Yeah. It sounded like Maki was in a bad mood. I feel I think I, I think Mew was bragging about her lab being open. But I don't think that would bother Maki since she's so well at it. I guess she heard something that she really did not want to hear. What are we go uh, what are we walking into? And we're <clears throat> hold on. And we're going to ask her for a favor. I don't feel good. Hold on, I need to check something before you go in the cafeteria. Okay. Let's see if the video no, it's not gonna work. Go on YouTube. Yay! Uh, and the Wi-Fi is like, oh you wanna go in the Wi-Fi? And then my phone's just like Wait, I can tell you the Wi-Fi. Cannot confirm. I can tell you I the Wi-Fi. I don't need the Wi-Fi. Oh. There, the yellow dot by those stairs. Behind you. No, that's Kyo. That's Kyo though. The other ones. Go go like across. Go across? Alright. The one that's just... No, they're the ones up here, right? Or down here? No. Wait. Because look, she's there. No, maybe she's there the next day. But. Oh, really? Is it in this day? But. That's... It says the morning after you go into the library of Suichi Saihara, which you've already done. Huh. I mean, okay, it could be tomorrow. It could be. But just. Okay, yeah, whatever. Just go in the Probably. Just go in the and she's definitely not here. It's a glitch in the system. Sumugi is Kyo the whole time. Yes. Okay. Oh, there she is. Mew- Okay, go ahead. Mew is sitting down, looking like her usual haughty self. Not haughty, but haughty. She seems like she's alone. Aww. Poor Mew. This is why nobody likes you. <laughs> Just kidding. Morning, Mew. Well, if it isn't flat chested, yeah, Kaye, this is why Kaye. nobody likes. What do you and what you want? Go, go, go! What do you and your pathetic kits want? I'll just pretend I didn't hear that. Um, I have a small favor to ask of you, you right, Shuichi? Yeah, actually, there's something that we want you to make. We found cameras and security sensors in the warehouse, and uh, do you think you can make cameras that detect movement and take pictures? As in, it would automatically take a picture if the motion sensor detects something. Huh? The hell are you gonna use that for? Ah, uh, um... uh, so ah, uh, to keep Monokuma under surveillance, we might learn important information. Yeah, exactly that. Please, Mew. We need your help to get everyone out of here. Oh, I see. Ah, okay, I get it now. Bitch. My answer is no. Huh? Oof. What? You, know. you plebs got a lot of nerve asking me for a favor. <laughs> were you were you, were you grubs in a past life? Is that why you don't understand basic human courtesy? All, I'll forgive you just this once. Now get out of here before I whip out the bug spray. Ooh. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Without thinking, my body moved on its own. What? Uh-oh. Oh. Please, Mew. Oh, <laughs> I thought she was gonna, like, shake her, or just, like, pin her to a wall, but no. I guess not. She's not physical. Come on. Sorry. No, not you. I'm talking. Oh, oh. It's I like, really you know. want to get out yeah. of here with everyone. 
And to do that, I like, need your on. help. So, Oof. please, Dang. I'm begging you. Kaede. Shuichi? I'm yeah. begging you too. We could really use your help, Mew. Please? What the hell? Quit bowing to me. No, I won't stop. I'm going to stay like this until you say you'll do it, Mew. Whoa. I'll do it for however long it takes. <laughs> uses bowing as a threat F fine I'll do it okay that's interesting huh what really oh, I God. grasp Mew's hand <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> thank you I owe you even after we escape I'll owe you forever and ever and ever I'm not doing this for you guys my research lab in the garden just opened up, so I was already thinking about checking it out. <laughs> so, can I, can I have my hand back now? Because this is starting to creep me out. What? Oh, sorry. I was just so happy. Hmm. But are your hands always this clean? <laughs> what did I do? Any, anyway, bring me the security sensors and cameras before I change my mind. What is wrong with her? I'll be waiting her? in my research lab in the garden. What is wrong with her? What is wrong with her? <laughs> okay. You wobbled out of the dining hall as if she had been thrown off balance. What's her issue? Nothing. Thank God. Her. I'm glad we managed to convince her. Something is up. I don't understand. Mm. Let's go to the warehouse to get the cameras and sensors right away. Wait, should I should I use the map or should I keep walking around? No, the warehouse is right across the hall. Oh. Where oh. are you going? Oh, wait. No! Should I walk around or should I go to the. I know, I'm sorry. I'm still getting. Shut up! I'm... I don't care anymore. I don't care. I'm still getting a grasps. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, crap. This I place is huge. I hope we can find all the things we're looking for. That's. Ah, don't worry. I know where the cameras and sensors are. I'll go to them. I'll go get them. You can wait here. Oh, are you sure? Hold on. After he said that, Shuichi walked to the back of the warehouse. Hold on. It's a high jump bar. Cool, I guess. It doesn't matter though, because we're gonna get out of this place. A remote controlled helicopter. What's this doing in a school warehouse? We could put a camera on it and just fly it. I'm just kidding. I can just imagine just the mastermind looking up. Huh? What's this? There's a wooden box. Are these iron balls? They look like they're for shot put. I picked one up to see if it was as heavy as it looked, and it was. The athletes who have to hurl these things are pretty impressive. Kaede, what are you doing? Oh, Shuichi, done already? Yeah, I've got the cameras. I think three should be enough. Disposable cameras? Will these work? Uh, um... That's all they said. Or that's all they had. But they work. It should be fine. There's also a photo developing solution here, so we won't have to worry about that. Mm. Well, if you're fine with them. Well. Kodak cameras? Yeah, these cameras should be okay. Also, here's a security sensor. When this sensor picks up movement, when this... yeah. Okay. It triggers the receiver to make a sound. And we should... wait. That looks like something you would put on a, like a, you know, like those, your keys. Okay, we should get uh, three of these as well. As huge as this warehouse is, I didn't expect it to have security sensors and stuff. Oh, do you want me to carry the cameras? I can put them in my backpack. I only have my music sheets and a spare vest, so there's still lots of room inside. All right, let's go talk to Miu. I Miu. Said, as I took the three disposable cameras from Shuichi, I suddenly stopped. I love you. Will these Just out of nowhere. Really work? Just out of nowhere. I love you. Even if we take pictures of the mastermind and persuade everyone, what will we do after that? The mastermind could just smirk and order the exosols to attack everyone. Can we really protect everyone with this plan? Will we really be able to escape this place? Kayede, is something wrong? We need to go before Mew changes her mind. Shuichi was already at the door of the warehouse, waiting for me. Oh, sorry. I shoved the things I was holding into my backpack. 
and ran after him. Second thoughts? Second thoughts you're having? Ooh. Here we go. Then... Alright, let's go to Mia's lab. I saw it in the courtyard. Oh, you mean the large building in the garden at the bottom of the stairs? Ah, hmm. uh, up until now, our research labs have been just normal classrooms. Well, that seems alright, doesn't it? Alright, let's just walk around, I guess. No, you gotta t you gotta go, 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 go. You want me to warp? Or do you want me to- And you just go, just go, walk. Okay. Hold shift. I am. Hold shift. That's literally the fast- this Hold is the, shift. The fastest I can Hold go. Hold shift, no one. I am! This is okay, shift! exit. Exit the building. <laughs> Hold shit, no one. <laughs> Okay, guess I gotta- do I have to talk to everyone? Yeah, I do. Come on, come on. Good morning, good morning to both of you. Spend time, spending time together again. I don't know anymore. Oh, I can't. Yeah, I'm sleepy. I couldn't sleep well last night. It took all my courage just to use the bathroom. But I guess people really can overcome their fears when they're really forced to. So she was holding it in? Oof. What about you, Tenkin? Oh, frick. Tangin? Tangin? <laughs> yeah. Kaede, say something to her. You haven't said anything this huh? whole time. What's going on? God, you scared me. I'm an old man now. Angie is trying to brainwash me and Hibiko with her oh. Atua nonsense. Oh, yes. It's freaking Tenkin voice. Tangin. Brainwash? I'm still answering Himiko's questions about Atua. Well, why, why? Yuri, what are you saying? Himiko of all people? <laughs> Tenko, why do you sound drunk? It sounds like Tango. Believes in Atua over magic? Magic. <laughs> well, both are hard to believe. It'll be okay. I don't believe in him. It's just strange to me that Angie isn't afraid of tomorrow's time limit. Nyahaha! Nyahaha! <laughs> because Atua has already welcomed me into his kingdom, so I might as well just kill someone. Or, I might as well get killed. Shut up, Atua. You guys not gonna get out of this goddamn situation. <laughs> Are you seriously gonna do that for now? Or just for this? Okay. Or Dylan hasn't huh? been able to You don't believe? It. Tenko? The only thing I believe in is our key. Hmm, I see. What about you, Himiko? I'm a mage. I'm a mage. I don't need to learn any pieces. I see, I see. I see, I see. Well, I suppose that's okay for now. Atua is a merciful god. He forgives everyone, even though who do, those who do not believe. And the non-believers always come around eventually. So divine. Oh, oh god, I thought she got big for a second, but then the illusion just kind of... Okay. Because uh, Atua is always with me. Nahaha, <laughs> how divine. I'm not looking anywhere. Anyway. Why are you... I will not be deceived by your words. <laughs> what the frick? Nor will Himiko either. Um, believing in Atua sounds like too much of a pain. That's a pain. Your reason? It's Neo Aikido. Himiko, you should believe in Aikido over Atua. That's a pain too. <laughs> <laughs> you freaking you think everything's a pain, you little shit? Hey, right. you're a pain, Kaede. She's a little shit. Alright. Pain. Alright, so. Go down. <laughs> Go down on the steps, man. Oh, yeah. I'm dying. And just laughing at this. Pain. He's just standing there menacingly. Menacingly! How exciting! I guess that building over there is Miu's lab. I saw me run over the, there earlier. She was all sweaty and ha had a total creeper smile. Creeper? Aw, oh, man. So we back in the... Oh, <laughs> what the... Goemon, it's Yusuke from Persona 5. Oh, wait. Whoa. I'm the only one who plays. Oh, is that... Oh, it's a steamroller. It's Monodam. Oh, no. Is that Monodam? <laughs> Dio! Oh. Dio Monodam. Dio Monodam? No, yeah, that's the right path. Now, I want to look at... Okay, I'm just admiring the robots. Oh, that's not a robot. Okay. That's not me's lab. It's the Shrine of Judgment. That's the Shrine of Judgment. This is pro- yeah, this looks like her lab. This looks like her lab. Oh. Knock, knock, knock! 
Right after I knocked, the door violently swung open. <laughs> it's just bam. You're, <laughs> you're fucking late! How dare you waste precious seconds of my time! Oh, looks like she's back again. Well, don't keep my golden brain waiting. Give me what you got! Should we do should we end this when the murder happens? Or the the death happens, I guess? For chance. Um, uh okay, it's just these, but I took out the three cameras from my backpack and handed them to me. What was that? Disposable cameras? Kodak cameras. It's Kodak cameras, guys. Um, are disposable cameras too difficult for, to modify for you? Brought to you by Kodak. Because, you know, disposable's where it's at. Huh? Huh? Do you ask bird watchers if they know how to gawk at dumbass birds? Of course I can do it! Piece of cake! Mm -hmm. Ah, here are the security sensors. Oh, so you want me to use these sensors to make the cameras take pictures automatically, right? Uh, um. I was thinking the camera should be triggered by a security sensor. As in, it's a sensor to test movement, the receiver goes off and sudden activates. Michi, are you okay? That's how I like to work Have it. Have you been smoking it's weed, Shuichi? <laughs> After I heard that, I whispered into Shuichi's ear. Are you smoking weed? <laughs> <laughs> are you on crack? <laughs> what are you going to use that crack for? Yeah, I am. That's... I'm going to sit on the bookcase moving bookcase. So you can store <laughs> it? <laughs> Wait, I didn't say... I didn't say that right. We're set on the bus case moving bookcase. I don't know. Now where we can make watch of anywhere. As long as the receiver with us. If someone moves the bookcase, the receiver the receiver will let us know, right? And the camera connected to the sensor will picture of whoever moved the bookcase. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. You mother Hey, what are you two whispering about? Nothing. Is that alright? I wrote down the details here. It sounds like he's trying to rap, but he just can't. <laughs> he's high. <laughs> Two cameras with built-in security sensors that'll take photos automatically. Disposable cameras. And a third camera that will trigger the sensor receiver as it automatically yeah. takes a photo. How soon do you need uh, these? Uh, could you make them by tomorrow morning? Shut up! Of course I can! You could tie me up and drip hot wax on me and I'd still finish it in time. With that bold declaration, Mew slammed the door in our In face. that case, finish it right now. <laughs> Did she just reveal some of her kinks to us? Man. Oh, hot wax being poured on her. That's disturbing. And no way, I think this will do it. I just have to, Should I have a freaking... I should have a Christopher... Wait, guys. Should I have a Christopher Walken voice for him? I don't know what that means. Christopher Walker. Oh, Christopher Walker is not Shuichi. <laughs> yes, he is. No, it's canon now. Wait, I don't know how to do it. Wait, anyway, I think this will do it. I don't know. I, I don't. I'm not good at that. Okay. We just had to wait for the meat to finish. Uh, the Mew? The Mew. Sounds like vine sauce. Hey, what's you? wrong? Why? Because no it's funny. Nothing. I just was just thinking about how your voice is so fucking the different. The book now. kiss. Okay, fine, I'll stop. <laughs> I was just thinking about how amazing you are for coming up with this plan, Shuichi. What? Honestly, when I first met you, I didn't think you would be that reliable. <laughs> but look at me now, relying on you like your show lo show lock ho shoe lock homes or something. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> My god, no, your voice. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. We, we went our separate ways and returned to our rooms, and I hope- Sleep starts? I hope that he wasn't smoking pot. <laughs> <laughs> no! The time limit expires at night 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 Oh, Let's do him, just because I feel something's <laughs> gonna happen with that bad boy. Very... <laughs> Jesus. Alright, what's he like? Monokuma said he wanted us to play his killing game no matter what. But what good does that do him? What's his goal? Should I spend time with Mioma? Only his reason... It's If only his... If only his only reason is to have fun, then... We might be in even more trouble than we thought. I spent some time discussing Monokuma's intentions with Ryoma. Oof. That's what you spent time doing? Instead of getting to know him better? Ryoma and I grew a little closer today. 
Would you like to give me your my present? Uh, yeah. Sixteen. Okay. Ah, yes. Ah, uh, yes. Cigarettes. Hmm, not bad at all. Sometimes even I want to feel happy, so I accept this, thanks. Sigh. Huh. <laughs> That's quite the sigh. Thank you! <laughs> if you're tired, why not go back to your room instead of spending time with me? Oh, sorry. I'm not actually tired. Yes, you are. I can tell. What In a situation like this, it'd be more surprising you. if you weren't, anyway. <laughs> well, don't worry about it. Okay. Arg, I Arg, feel less too. tired if there was at least one animal around here. Well, there are several bears. They don't count. Hmph. Well, they certainly aren't the kind of animal that'd make you feel at ease. Right? Jeez, I just want a soft, fluffy animal. I wonder if there are any around here. Hmph. I get that. Once you start petting one, you forgot you forget w about all your worries. So you like animals too, Mioma? Well, I don't dislike them. You sure about that? You looked a lot more relaxed when I went to the animal. What? Oh, did I get it right? Shh, you tricked me. Well played. I only said what's true. Your soft spot for animals is written all over your face. So what kind of animals do you like, Mioma? Cats are the best. <laughs> Ryoma's cat boy. Really? You have a cat? I used to. When I was in when I went to prison, I had someone I know take care of it. Oh, I see you. I used to pet him after tennis practice. He was calm and smart. He'd know when I was tired and come over to let him let me pet him. He had a nice fluffy coat. Like my cat. Watching him go wild over cat and it calmed me down. Except my cat doesn't my floofy cat does not like to go outside. Okay. Ryoma's expression had softened. You must really like cats. I want a cat too! Fluffy cats are the best. I bet it's waiting for your, you to return. What if it's dead? Should I say that? Should I say this or this? You'd say... I don't know. It might be dead, but just say I bet it's waiting for you to return. Yeah. I bet it's waiting for you to return. I wonder about that. I heard that cats forget their gratitude after three days. Yeah. Actually, I, I, I kind of knew something of that sort. That's a myth. No way a cat could forget about the person who took care of it. Do you think it'll die from loneliness if you don't see it again? Like rabbi rabbits do? Don't talk to ra don't talk to me about rabbits. I'm wearing a <laughs> no. Hmm. <laughs> it seems that a pop that that's a popular myth too. Huh? Really? But yeah, the first thing I'm going to do once I get out of prison is try to go get him. <laughs> Just thinking about you playing with a cat. It's pretty much the cutest thing ever. All he wants to do is just pet his cat, man. Wait, Let's let him do it. Wait. Cheese. Wait, no one. What? What? I swear I heard Jack whining in the distance. Aww. <laughs> Jack's like, father. <laughs> father. Cheese. Cheese. Don't go judging people by their appearance. Oh, yay. Your a report card, yay. Okay. Is he there? Uh, okay. Go ahead, Ethan. Read the God Forsaken. Don't let him After in. parting ways with Yoma, I return <laughs> to my room. Great, Ethan. Great. Okay, who should I hang out with next? Uh. Kurumi. Let's do it. For you. Right. Let's do it for you. Okay. Let's see what we're doing. won't start for a while, so I guess it's better. I'll see what everyone else is doing. We're doing Kurumi. Whoa, Nolan, you what? haven't even taken her out to dinner yet. Calm down. Wait, that's no, I'm doing this for Ethan. I'm for Dylan. <laughs> You're doing this for me? No, shut up. I'm so sorry. It's Kurumi time. I'm probably just gonna try to hang out with everyone this round. You know, you know, as much as I can. Not everyone, but if they, you know, some might I miss. I might miss. But... The time limit will expire soon. Who will make the first move? Anything can happen now. Don't tap me. Should I spend time with Kirumi? I am here to serve everyone. Are you now? So if someone wishes to survive, I will fulfill that request. I see this. Oh. Everyone's just like, I want to survive! <laughs> I spent some time with Kirumi. Kirumi and I grew a little closer. It doesn't have that brrrr, which is whatever. Yes. Would you like to give him a moment with the black one? 
43. Okay. 43. You don't have 43. Okay. 53. You don't have 53. 97. No, 54. Ah! Good, of course. Is that a love or a like present? Love. Mm -hmm. I never told you I needed this, but it is truly, is it truly our right for me to have this? Thank you. This will help me immensely. If I use this, this can help everyone as well. How can I help you? Kaede, Kaede. Oh, wow. sorry. There is something I need, there's something. Is there anything you wish for me? Kaede, <laughs> is there anything you wish for me to do? Huh? There was something for you. Your line there. Huh? huh? Not at the moment. It's like, it's like the second Ethan stole my line, I just died. My voice is just like, cannot, uh, cannot respond. Cannot. Cannot compute. <laughs> Why are you speaking to me? Why? Oh, that's right. Kirumi's a maid. So she probably thinks I want her to do something for me. Sorry, Kirumi, for giving you the wrong idea. I just wanted to have a chat with you. You know, without any of the ultimate maid stuff. Have a chat? With me? Of course, I do not mind such requests. It's not a request, but more like, well, I don't want to make this more complicated. To be quite frank, I wish to speak with you as well, Kaede. Mm. Really? That's unexpected. Mm. Is it? Yeah. yeah, we don't have much in common. Oh, but I'm happy to talk anyway. Ask me anything. Thank you. I have prepared some questions I would like you to answer. Are you the mastermind? <laughs> Kirumi <laughs> took out a notebook. <laughs> what? These questions all concern food. Oh, what? Okay. Do you have any food allergies I should be aware of? Bruh, <laughs> just no. <sighs> um, no, I don't have any. I like, I like how she's just like, food no. You to test? No, I do not. I do not believe so. I don't know. She's... I can't think hmm. of any foods that I really like or really hate. Let's see. I see. She's so serious about I everything. see. Most impressive. Look at her eyebrows. Then I shall move on to my to my next. <laughs> Sorry. My next question. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> those are some bushy eyebrows. How are those bushy? Do you have a preference for certain bedding materials? Bedding materials? Yes. For example, do you prefer down, buckwheat, memory foam, or cotton pillows? <laughs> memory foam. <laughs> the Tempur Pedic bed. <laughs> um, the pillow I have right now is good enough. Why is she asking? For what this? are you planning? Is this some kind are of you doing research? Pillows, Pillows are important. <laughs> yeah. Pillows are important. Yes. Yes. <laughs> a proper pillow will not only ensure a good night's rest, but prevent maladies as well. Maladies? Maladies? <laughs> the pillows in the dormitory room seem adequate, I suppose. But I would prefer that everyone have their own custom pillow. I understand. I get it. Um, I understand. Why well, should. <laughs> But why are you so concerned about that? Why wouldn't I be concerned? You don't get it, do you? You don't get it, do you? Your comfort matters very much to me, Kaede. Hence my questions. With the information you have provided, I can provide you with greater service. Huh? What? You do all that for me? Not just for you, but for everyone else as well. She's literally... She literally is a robot. No, she's a... She acts she's the like mom. The ultimate mom. <laughs> Once we are finished here, I intend she has to no present emotion. these questions to the others. She has no emotion. Oh, that's why she wanted to talk. I am a maid after all. She has no emotion! She has no emotion! She has no emotion! <laughs> if you are not content for any reason, please call for me and I shall fulfill any request. Yeah. Even the most ridiculous request. Okay, thanks. <laughs> we shall not deny a guest even the most ridiculous <laughs> request. Kirumi sure does love to take care of him. Yay! Yay! After parting ways with Kirumi, I return to my room. Yay! Next death, next death. Just kidding, it's at night. So wait, I don't think we'll make it. We'll see. Do you guys want to just keep going until it just... Who cares? Just want to keep going? Just until we get to it? Keep going. We gotta keep going. We're gonna reach the death. This is an announcement. This is an official announcement from the this Ultimate Academy. It is now 10 p.m. For one, for one of you bastards, this might be your last nighttime ever. Don't do something violent to start off the killing game. You can make it one more night. We? Oh, I get it now. I totally get it. He's still like queasy. Uh, it's crystal clear to me now. I understand everything. See, look at your face. The way your eyes are angled. The way your face is floating. 
That's a crazy face. <laughs> Mono Kid seems really out of it. <laughs> is this that what happens when you drink too much honey? Drink too much honey? Wait, do you drink honey or eat honey? Wait, do you drink honey or eat honey? Drink. Scrum debate. <laughs> Hold the phone. Last night time ever, huh? No, it won't be our last night time ever. Just our last night in this horrible place. Tomorrow night. I'm getting out of this place with everyone else. Are platypuses mammals? Just kidding, of course they're mammals. <laughs> yeah, we promised we would all be friends once we got here. <laughs> you guys looked at me like, what the frick, Nolan? <laughs> uh, he's, he's a semi-aquatic egg-laying mammal of action. I hear kids these days don't even say thank you anymore. <gasps> oh, yes. I blame the pants. They haven't properly taught them the true meaning of thank you. Ooh, nice. French. It's very important to express gratitude to someone who has done something for you. It will make that person feel happy, and they might do something special. <gasps> a rat! <laughs> a rat in the kitchen! In other words, thank you isn't just about conveying gratitude. It also conveys the expectation of a favor in the future. So the more you say thank you, the more you can use that to people around you. So always say thank you to people, and make them do lots of stuff to your benefit. Okay. You come to me, the day of my daughter's wedding. You come to me, the day of my daughter's wedding. Rise and shine or shine. It is now he's like, he's still, how is he still like that? This is an official academy from the ultimate... <laughs> Why is he still... This is an official academy from the ultimate announcement. Wake up, bastards, it's 8 a.m. Oh, today's the day the time limit expires. My heart is pounding with excitement. Don't worry. Don't worry. Even if you end up in hell, at least you can be proud that you didn't do the killing game. You're you just assuming they're gonna go to hell? This, this is it. You and Sixty are triangle. Who triangle circle to leave tri to leave square and come circle as triangle square humans. Hey, Mono Kid, why don't you shut about shapes? Why don't we go over there and geom? It's not geometry class. And drink some more honey, okay? Wait, what? Oh, honey. <laughs> So he literally... Okay. The time limit was set to expire tonight, but weirdly enough, I was looking forward to it. Even then, I barely slept the whole night. I slapped my cheeks. And she slapped her bed. butt cheeks? <laughs> I slapped my cheeks and leaped out of bed. You come to me on the day of my daughter's wedding and slap my cheeks. <laughs> All right. First, I need to go to Shuichi's room. We're gonna catch the mastermind Sorry. and slap our cheeks together. My bad. <laughs> I wasn't even. <laughs> I'm dying. Dun, 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 dun. Ding dong! Ding dong, ding dong! Huh? No response. I wonder if something's the matter. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -huh. Oh, shrimp. <laughs> Nolan. <gasps> ah. Something's wrong. Wait, what are you what are you saying my name for? Go on. Okay. <laughs> okay, I will. <laughs> Go on then. Hi Katie, good morning. Jeez, finally you came out of the closet. I can't believe you're gay now. You had me nervous there sorry. for a second. Oh, uh, sorry. I was just going to bathroom. Are you ready then? I'll stop. You have to get the I'll cameras stop. from you, remember? Okay. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, are you asking me? Huh? I didn't do anything. No, not me. Who could be? Me? No, no. Me. I ate my grandma. No! <laughs> guys, he said the funny, he said the funny <laughs> word. Hey, you guys! <laughs> hey! Right. Hey, guys! Get the f out of my restaurant! Okay. Hey, hey! You come, hey, to, me hey. <laughs> you come to me on the day of my daughter's wedding. All right. Hey, hey! My daughter's restaurant. <laughs> you come to me on my day. All right. <laughs> hey, hey! Have you decided how you want to spend your final moments? 
Maybe you want to pray to Atwa with me. Well, what? You shouldn't be getting up that easily. Yeah, true, true. Oh, you took it so long so well. That's what we were doing the other to the dining hall. Jesus Christ. Huh? What are you talking about? Atua has spoken in such dire times. Now they stop. <laughs> Atua has spoken in such dire times, my <laughs> <Mi> amigo. <laughs> Why don't they stop fighting? <laughs> fighting? Oh. Um, they're fighting in the dining hall. Atua was really bummed out about it. Fighting in the dining hall. I'm just hall. switching her voice so Shmichi, much. Shmichi, can you go get the stuff from you? I have to see what's happening. Leave it to me. <laughs> Okay, I'll go get the cameras. Why, Shuichi, why does your voice change every day? <laughs> it's gonna meet up later in the classroom by the stairs to the basement. Wait, is this just gonna be the whole thing? You're gonna change his voice? Okay, alright, yes. classroom by the stairs No, to the I'm basement. not. I've stopped. Okay, got it. Angie, you said the dining hall, right? Do you mind coming with me? Mm -hmm. Uh, uh <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, okay. Okie dokie! Well, we'll stop it together! <laughs> Okie dokie! Nolan, are you getting high? I think Nolan... <laughs> Keep going. Who's fighting though? Who's fighting who though? And why? I don't care. Okay, let's go to Nolan. the... Nolan, <laughs> <laughs> you're legitimately... <laughs> Wait, you're gonna pass by the yellow dot. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> oh yeah, no, you need to go get the yellow dot. <laughs> okay. It's important today. Oh, okay. Hmm, what's up? You look super panicked. Are you here to stop the fighting? Yes, I am. If you know about the fight, why aren't you stopping? Why should I? Something's finally happened to break up all the boring tedium. Boring? Because, you know, don't you, Kayede? The time limit ends at 10 p.m., right? It's just around the corner. If people feel like they need to take action to survive, who are you to stop them, Kayede? Jeez, this would be way simpler if I could just share, share Shuichi's plan with everyone. But, by the time, by the same token, who am I to stop you from stopping them? So, go stop them, I believe in you. That's definitely a lie. You need to go get the other yellow dot. The other yellow dot. Over there, over there, over there, over there. I'm running as fast as I can. Come to the day of coming my through, coming through, coming through, coming through now. Coming through, coming through, coming through now. Oh, Maki, did you hear about the fight in the dining hall? Yeah, hey. Angie told me. Stay out of it. I can't just stay out of it. Why not? Huh? Because it could start the killing game? No. That's right. I won't let it happen. Right. Then what are you wasting time with me for? Get out of here. Get out of here! Go She's on, you right. stupid, I need dumb hurry. animal! <laughs> okay. Let's go to the... Dining hall. Dining hall. Huh? huh? This door was blocked before. When did it become accessible? What, what do you mean? It was accessible before! <laughs> Wait, wasn't it? No. We went through it. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. No, we, didn't. we did. I think we did. Yeah, I know we did. What's going on here? Remember you said. Oh, Kaede. Perfect timing. I really don't know what to do, Kaede. Ryoma started talking crazy. I, all I was doing was making a suggestion. So that, so that more people can survive, even if it's just one more. We're going to make it to the freaking... What does Ryoma have to say? We just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. So that more people can survive? Ryoma, what do you mean Don't by you that? Get it. Don't you get it? If time runs out like this, we'll all be get annihilated, you know. The only way to avoid that is to play along with this killing huh? game. What? Now, hold on a minute. Kill me. Huh? huh? Ryoma, what are you saying? Called it. <laughs> Called it. Called it. Called it. Almost. We'll see. You don't get that either. I'm saying that you, I'll give you guys my life. It's always literally the li the, the the oddball guy looking guy. I mean, I know that Kibo's is oddball, but I mean the little guy. It's always the weird looking. 
guy who dies I first. Like how you say that about Leon. And Teru Teru. Zayaka. Leon and Zayaka. So if the rest of you want to live, <laughs> yes, I'll hand my life over. I'm <coughs> talking about. Sorry. What's wrong? No way. We promised we'd all get out of this, out of here together. Hmm. But what about your cat? <laughs> <coughs> I hoped it'd end that way. That's why I waited so long to bring this up. Bless you. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> but we, but we've just been waiting for the deadline without doing anything to change it. There's no more to time left for idealism, don't you think? No, no, it's not idealism. This is the best choice for the situation. Whoever murders me gets to leave without a trial. Everyone else survives the time limit. After that, the person who gets to escape can go for help and rescue everyone else. How about it? If you've got a better idea, I'd love to hear it. Well, then how about um, you kill someone, and then they can go and get help. Or then you can go and get help, because we trust you and you seem like you would do something like that. Um, well, or Kibo. Kibo would do that too. What are you, Nolan, you're talking over. What are you, are you over there? Sorry. What should I do? Maybe, I sh maybe if I share Shuichi's plan with him, Ryoma will change his mind. Ryoma, there's no need for that. Hmm? I'm going to end this game. There's no need for that because I'm going to end this game. I've already what? decided. You're going to end this game? It's not about outfoxing everyone in this killing game. It's about ending the game itself. Just by killing himself? That's the real goal. Can you even accomplish such a feat? Yeah. I wouldn't be saying this <laughs> if I didn't think I could. And how will you end it? You understand that the time limit expires tonight, yes? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, can't tell you. Actually, if I could, I wouldn't be having so much trouble. What do you mean? Just what I said. I'm going to end this game. So don't any of you go and do anything unnecessary, alright? Okay. What? Unnecessary? You've still got ways to hmm. go. When you put it like that, it seems like I have <clears throat> a ways to go. All right, I got it. I All take right, back. I take a piss. <laughs> I take back my suggestion. Do you want? Do you, what? Do what you want. Whether you guys live or die is up to you. He disappeared while pissing. <laughs> oh God! He's, He's like changed the world. <laughs> <laughs> my final message. Goodbye. Peace. Peace. After Rioma said that, he left the That's dining hall. Jeez, that Rioma. I hope I helped calm him down a little. Anyway, Rantaro, were you serious when you said you knew a way to end this yeah. game? Not sure. Huh? What? Well, even if I did have an idea, I couldn't tell you. Can't risk anyone interfering. Your time. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Just kidding. <laughs> then Angie will pray for you. A strategy success, Rantaro. But if you're lying, Atua says he will punish you for three generations to come, okay? <laughs> now that's a threat. Well, I'll do my best to live up to your expectations, hmm? Actually... I guess I have to do my best. Rantaro left, but what he had said really affected me. Ending this game? Is that even possible? I suspect he only said that to defuse the situation and stop Ryoma. I mean, ending this game. <laughs> you don't know that! Because maybe I'm just kidding. Maybe Rantaro's hidden talent is actually a huge explosion. In the end, only Atua knows. Rantaro's hidden talent. Wait, sorry, I'm using Rantaro's voice. Hey, shit. <laughs> Hang on. Rantaro's hidden talent. I want to know what it is, but we don't have much time left. I can't worry about that now. What? What is he doing there? I need to do something. There, Rantaro's there too. Wait, what the Ryoma. Wait, wait, what? I don't have time to worry about things I don't understand. Like two people who walked away still here. I just need to do what I can. Or else I won't be able to protect everyone. I should go meet up with Shuichi. It's the classroom by the stairs to the basement, right? Okay, where's Samugi been this whole time? <laughs> Chilling in a hot tub. Five feet apart. She's in the bathroom. <laughs> okay, go by the classroom by the basement. Okay. <laughs> Got you. Is it... Is there a downstairs? Yeah. Nope, that's an upstairs. Nope, nope. You're going the right way. Don't go upstairs, though. Yeah. Oh. oh. Wait, you just passed oh. the dog. Oh, sorry. Oh, there's Gonta. Gonta be right there. 
Kaede, something happened? Gunta see Rantaro walk by. His face looks scary. Yeah, about that. Ryoma and Rantaro got into a no, fight. You do that. Fight? Fight? Where? Gunta go stop no. them. No, it's fine now, so you don't need to worry about sorry. it. Sorry. Oh, oh, sorry. Gunta not know where he needed most. No. Don't worry about it. If Banji hadn't told me, I wouldn't have known about it either. <sighs> okay. That's right. Anyway, Kirumi, Kyo, and Angie are all in the dining hall today. How about you eat breakfast with them? Oh, Gunta. Really? Then Gunta also go to dining hall. Yay! We. <laughs> okay, you bye do bye that. Now. You do that, big guy. All right. Oh God, there you are. <laughs> Jesus Christ! What the fuck have you been? Oh, I thought somebody was standing up there. <laughs> I think I think we missed that interaction, the secret one. It was Dang. probably the day. Good morning, Kaede. It was the morning after they first go to the library. Oh, we missed her. Not the. It's the morning where she goes. There's a door. Oh. Dang it. It's the morning. morning that. Darn it, we missed it. Hey, so earlier I saw Shuichi. Should we still do e go to everyone then? Is it still worth it? Yeah. Um, I saw Shuichi come out of Mir's research lab. Oh, you don't say. I heard, I wonder what he's doing in there so early in the morning. I don't think there's that anything happened, but in life or death situation like this, you'd expect people to start a development feelings for each other, right? Um, I think so, because I'm in love with Shuichi. Yeah, you're right. Now is not the time for that! <laughs> the time limit's up tonight, okay? Oh, Rick! Okay, Rick. After going so much- After going through so much, it's strange, but I feel like I'm come to expect it! Ah, uh, I should've spent the last day of my life! Okay, fishy boop. Oh. Bye-bye. <laughs> Samuki? You didn't question when going to did it. Samuki? I thought that was literally, like, before, I thought that was, like, Kokichi's towering over us, like, <laughs> well, well, well. Well, well, well. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Oh! There you are! We're already are. an hour and 41 minutes. Should we cut off? The no! Day? We don't make it to the we're death. Almost there. Yeah, we're almost there. Sorry I'm late, Shuichi. No. You don't know that, Nolan. <laughs> Only I know that, and he knows that. Wait, never mind, it doesn't say the day or time. <laughs> ah, it's alright. I just got here too. How did it go? Did Mew finish the cameras? She must have been working all night. She was even too tired to make fun of me. Anyway, here's the result. Two cameras that will make take a picture. Make a picture. When the sensor detects movements. Remember. And this one will take a picture and trigger the receiver. Of course, they're turned off right now, so they aren't taking any pictures. Since they... Since they're disposable cameras, we'll have to manually wind the film, no. right? Yes, Miu thought of that. Uh, she told me that the cameras will wind automatically. So once they're set up, they'll take pictures every time the sensor is okay. triggered? She also modified them so that they'll be completely silent, not to attract attention. Hey. They're completely silent. This is perfect. Wow. It needs to be... These are absolutely essential for to our plan. And do these cameras have flashes? That's... Yeah, they still have flashes on them, but I switched them off. They shouldn't be a problem. That shouldn't be a problem. Uh, but we need to make sure they don't get turned on by accident or at the mastermind. Yeah, I'll be careful. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. I'm impressed, though. You <laughs> modified them to our to our specifications. All right. I'll tell you a little bit about our class about this classroom before we set it up in the library. Huh? Tell me about this classroom. Is that all right? Yes, I think this is a perfect place to keep watch after we set up the cameras. That's fine, but why this classroom? Because we can see anyone who goes down to the basement with the door open a little. Oof. You can see the staircase, right? Yeah, you're right. We can give a lookout for anyone who goes down to the basement. Uh, hey. Excuse. There's one more reason I chose a specific classroom. One more reason? Okay. Go on. Go on, yeah. It's because of something... something that's only here. Oh. <laughs> well, before that. Ah! Ah! This doesn't seem like the other reason. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh! Is this a vent? That's... 
It's connected to the library in the basement. You'll recognize the smell immediately. The smell? After Shuichi told me that, I leaned in closer to the vent. Oh, it smells like musty old books. Does this lead to the library? It's probably a vent to control the humidity in the library. Remember. Remember, the duct tape we noticed in the basement hallway. It leads here. The duct tape? I see. Yes, duct tape. But Did I say vent, that wrong? But a vent in the classroom, that's an odd design choice for a school. Then the duct. Again, everything about this school is odd. Uh, um. This vent in the, is the other reason I chose a specific classroom to keep watch. This vent is just big enough for someone to be able to fit, so we should watch this carefully too. I don't think I could fit in there. Well, maybe I could, but it'd be tough. Yeah. Well, I guess this is the perfect spot to keep a look at. Anyway, it's time. We should set up the cameras now. It's finally time to set our plan into motion. I'm getting nervous. Yeah. My heart is racing. Is your heart racing, Nolan? I'm not kidding. Okay. Let's go to the library. Oh my god. Somebody's gonna... Okay. It's already good. Downstairs. Downstairs, Nolan. Downstairs. There you go. Shut up. There you go, buddy. There Shut up. Go. Okay, buddy, retard. Okay, buddy, retard. <laughs> Wait, I just realized. The Reddit. You know what? There, there was a, there were like windows to the stairs leading to the basement, like windows under the ground. Oh. Big brain. <laughs> so where did you want to place the camera? How do the books keep getting set up every time I freaking? Okay. Right. There's just some, the mastermind comes in every time. Just like, <laughs> God damn it, who keeps knocking these all down? <laughs> but same the one who linked the receiver at the moving bookcase. If we place a security sensor on the bookcase itself, that then, when it opens, the receiver will let us know. Mm -hmm. And if we place the camera to face the moving okay. bookcase... Yes, the camera should capture the exact moment the mastermind moves the bookcase. Mm -hmm. Then where are we putting the other two sensors? Remember. Well, there are two entrances to the library. The front entrance near the stairs, and the rear entrance to the hallway. Let's aim one at each entrance. That, <coughs> excuse me, that way, we'll have pictures of everyone who enters the library. How, how, but how about over there? Over there! Um, over there! You say a person could fit through the vent that connects to the classroom? Oh! Wait, shouldn't we make sure a person could actually fit through it? That's... I think it will be fine, since we'll be keeping watch in the classroom. But we should investigate a little, a little more, just in case. But we can't reach that high. Hmm. We need something to stand on. Hmm. A ladder. I'm smart. Oh, I I'm can big brain. Use this ladder. I'm big brain. I positioned the ladder below the vent and climbed up. Oh God. Whoa. Hello. Now that I'm Whoa. up here, this is Wait. pretty high. Yeah. Kind of scary. But do you want to switch? Nah, I'm fine. Switch. So each is a switch. My, um, delicate. Uh, sorry. Bruh. <laughs> 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 well, whatever. He can't unsee them. Anyway, this is the vent. There's a grate covering the vent, so I don't think anyone can go through. Can I take the grate off? You know, you know what would be smart, actually. Forget it. There we go. Er. Oh. The grate came off pretty easily. Did you break something, Kaede? Um, no. I didn't break it. I saw the look on his face. He probably thinks I'm a klutz. I pushed the grate into the duct. The duct tape? Then I lifted my body and looked so inside. How's it look? Could a person fit in there? Hmm. It would be pretty difficult, but you might be able to call for it. Ryoma could! I can't really get uh? the vent with all these books in the way, though. Well, you'll be able to see the entrance to the vent in the classroom. So that should be okay, right? Just in case, I'll stack more books around the vent so no one can get through. With that, I began to arrange the books around the vent. After I finished stacking the books, I climbed down the ladder. Are you okay? Kaede, what's wrong? Yeah. This will work. This will definitely huh? work. Huh? You got it? You're doubting yourself? I think this plan might actually protect everyone. Yeah, it definitely will. This plan is perfectly composed like Chopin's ballads. Yeah. I actually really like con complicated contraptions like Rube Goldberg machines and stuff. So I'm positive this will work. 
The setup is perfect. Y you really think so? Of course. We'll definitely catch the mastermind, and then we'll all escape. Oh, right. So let's hurry and set up the cameras. Yes, so I think it will. Yes, so I think it will be a good idea to set the cameras between books so that. Oh, hold on. I had an idea while I was on top of the bookcase. What if we place a camera up there? I'm sure the mastermind will notice it. Ah, but with all the books stacked on top, I don't know if there's room for the camera. Then I'll test it out while you prepare the sensor on the bookcase. I'll organize the books on top of the bookcase and see if I can make room for a camera. Right. That way, we won't waste any time, right? Okay. Y yeah, that sounds like a good idea. All right then, let's do it. I climbed. Oh. I climbed up the ladder and looked at the top of the bookcase. Hmm. hmm. There are way more books here than I expected. The top of the bookcase is covered end to end with cluttered stacks of oh, books. Right. This is nothing. As I moved the ladder, I reorganized the books, bit by bit. Jeez, there are too many books. It might be too hard to set up a camera here. Hmm, I thought so. Wait, I just gotta try a little harder. Hey. Kayede, I know you don't like to admit defeat, but really it's alright. I continued moving the ladder as I kept reorganizing the books. Chapter 1's long, isn't it? <laughs> Pretty long. Yeah. Jeez, these books are so heavy. What is this, an encyclopedia? I flipped open the book. Wait! Ah, Kaede, is this really the time to be reading a book? Sorry, I get distracted easily when I'm organizing things. After I made that excuse, I rushed to reorganize the heavy books, but... Um... Looks like there are too many books after all. You can't really make space, can you? It'd be easier if I could move them to the ground, but that would look suspicious. Right. Yeah, we have to minimize any risk of the mastermind noticing the cameras. Then I guess it'd be harder to put the camera between the book, or it guess it'd be better to put the camera between the books, like you suggested. Right? Yeah. <laughs> you look oddly happy. No, no, I don't. Ah, if we put them on top of the bookcase, the angle wouldn't quite reach. Arg! And I thought I'd, and here I thought it'd be a good idea. Right? So about the places to put the cameras. Oof, he's made a whole plan. We decided to place the security sensor on top of the moving bookcase, what? Sorry. And the camera linked to it will be set up right here. That way, it will capture the movement moment the mastermind moves the bookcase. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, the other top. That's you. Go We're going to place the other two cameras near the exit and entrance, right? I suppose so. I think here, and this bookcase is good. They would have to pass by here no matter which door they used. Yeah, sounds good. That makes sense. Ow. Mm -hmm. Then I'll set up the camera that's connected to the security sensor. I'll set it carefully so the camera has a clear shot when the mastermind moves the bookcase. Mm -hmm. Let me take care of the security sensor on top of the bookcase. And we'll set the cameras near each door. Oh, I almost forgot. I brought the duct tape from the warehouse. You can use this. Yeah. Thanks. With that, we got to work. I meticulously placed the cameras in the gaps of the bookshelf. You need to set up the camera carefully so that it's aimed at the moving bookcase. I better use a lot of the duct tape so the camera won't fall out of position. These cameras are important, so I gotta do it right. Looks almost really like cheese. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Alright, that should okay. be it. I'm finished too. Jesus, I'm finished too! <laughs> So, no matter which entrance they use, the mastermind will be caught on camera. And if they move the bookcase in front of the hidden door, the sensor will detect that. And the signal and signal the receiver. Mm -hmm. Oh, and at that moment, the camera attached to the sensor will snap the critical picture. I know I shouldn't be asking this, but yeah. when's the next death? <laughs> this should do it. No doubt about it. This plan will probably work. No, not just probably. It will definitely work. Alright then, the final step. Turn the sensors on. Oh, right. We should turn them on before we leave. There's a 10 second delay as it starts up, so we have to leave quick. Got it. It'd be a waste of film if it took our pictures. Yeah. True. After setting our trap and powering on the cameras attached to the sensor, 
We quickly exited the library. Hopefully they did it correctly. Oh, my heart. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now we wait for the mastermind to show themselves. Okay. Uh, there's still some time left. Do you want to go see anybody? God, God. oh my... I'd rather focus on the planet. God, I'm scared. Besides, I'm sure everyone else is safe. <laughs> yeah, Plus, right. once we get out of here, I'll have all the time in the world to see. Right. That's true. Well, let's go to the classroom. Oh, man. God, God man. Okay, Up sir. The stairs. Look, Ow. there are windows right there. Oh, God. One of my favorite parts of the, in the entire game is about to happen. Oh, yeah. I what, really? Favorite? You'll see. Also, the sky is now orange. <gasps> it's nighttime already. Dot, dot, dot. Shh, just keep going. Okay, go ahead. Upon I really want to see this. A wave of anxiety suddenly overwhelmed me. My heart felt like it would beat out of my chest at any moment. Then... <clears throat> Let's keep the door open a little. Then we can see anyone going to the basement. Yeah. Uh, um... Akeide. Akeide, about the security sensor receiver. Hey. Could you hold on to it, please? I just feel like you, you'd be better suited for that than me. Ah, there's a power switch on it. Make sure you don't turn it on by accident. No. off by accident. No. You hold on to it, Shuichi. You're the one who came up with this plan, and I trust you. Um... Also, Shuichi... You just said I'm better at you than something. Why do you always say things like that anyway? Huh? You know? I guess it's good that I good I guess it's good that we have some some time left to talk. Because I wanted to talk uh, to you about that. Um... Talk to me? Oof. <laughs> Should we just keep going? Keep going. Okay. We're almost there. Okay. You know? It's probably none of my business, but I think you should be more All confident. Right? Especially since the ultimate initiative selected you as the ultimate detective. No. no, really. I shouldn't be the ultimate detective. I'm not even a real detective. Huh? What do you mean? I'm... I didn't even really want to be a detective. My uncle runs a detective business. I would sometimes help out as an, as an apprentice. Oh, I see. You're not, like, uh, you're not like Kyoko at all. It was usually just cheating couples, background uh -huh. checks. But one day I came across a murder case, completely by chance. Uh, um, I solved it before the police did, and they called me the boy detective. Uh, that's when I got scouted by the ultimate initiative, uh, though I only solved one case. Even so, it's still amazing that you solved a murder case. Most people can't do no. that. I wonder. I wonder if uh, I was really good at a thing I saw, a good, a good thing I solved that case. The look on his oh. face. Like he hated me more than anything else in the world. Later I heard that he murdered the victim to get revenge for his family. The victim was abusive. They drove the culprit's relative to suicide. People told me that the culprit was right to do what he did. The victim deserved it. But I led the police right to him. Of course he hated me. Oof. That's not true. It's not like you took sides. You uncovered the truth. That's what detectives do, right? You're right. Yeah, I uncovered the truth, which makes it my fault, and I'm still suffering the uh. consequences. Ever since that one stupid case, I've been so afraid of uncovering the truth. I'll never forget those eyes, the hatred, the way they stared into me. Uh, um, uh, anyway, that's why I have trouble looking people in the eyes sometimes. Why well, a hat too? So oh. that's why he wears the eyeliner. No, oh, I'm not a real detective, Kayade. What kind of stupid detective is afraid of finding the truth? Right then, I noticed Shuichi's hands were trembling. Oh. I gently reached out and held his hand. Oh, oh we get to see it. We get to see it. We get to see it. Where it is. I wish there was a piano here. I would play you a song to help you cheer up. Aww. <laughs> she just does the <laughs> bing, 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 bing. I ruined it. <laughs> oh, Claire de Lune. There it is. I can play that. No. It calms your heart, like the moon's reflection on water. No. You noticed, huh? Yeah. I'm shaking too. But I'd be a mess if you weren't here. I wouldn't have been Aww. able to do anything. I would have been so lost. I'm glad you're here with me, Shuichi. With you by my side, I feel like I can stand up to anything. You give me the courage I need to take on the mastermind. So please. 
be more confident. I believe in you. So you should definitely believe in yourself. Yes. Okay, I'll try. I don't know if I can. This is so wholesome. Yep. I know. That's a prompt. Still funny to me though. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so dumb. After letting go of his hand, I quickly changed the subject. Yeah, that's right. Also, I think you would look way cooler if you didn't wear that hat. Huh? But what are you talking about? Huh? What? I'm serious here. Once we're out of here, I want you to show me what you look like without the hat, okay? <laughs> well. <laughs> Jeez, I just want to see everyone smile. You know? I love seeing the expressions people make when they're enjoying themselves. That's why I play piano. To see the smiles on everyone. Literally, uh, Kyoko is a detective and she has like gloves on her hands. She's hiding her hands, now he's hiding his head. Ah. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> and that's why we need to expose the mastermind and this dumb killing game. Right? So we can smile with everyone else. Gosh dang. Mastermind just walks in. It is not dumb! <laughs> <laughs> okay. It is not dumb! It is not dumb! <laughs> It's a killing game. After a serious talk, television show. we talked about this and that to try and kill some time. We did all we could and prepared for whatever happened next. I was nervous, of course. But all we could do was wait for the moment to arrive. As the time limit drew closer and closer. And then suddenly, the moment arrived. <gasps> Here we go. Oh god. Wait, what's happening? What? Huh? What is this weird music? Is it coming from that monitor? Could it be? But maybe it's a warning that we need to start the killing. The time limit is almost up. They need to stop screwing with us. How much suffering do they want from us? Wait, wait Kaede. I hear people talking in the hallway. Huh? People talking? Uh-oh. Oh. Who's it gonna be? I focused my attention on the hallway. It could be anybody! I could hear a group of boys and girls talking. Okay. I bet your heart is racing. <laughs> my heart's racing, and I'm, I know what happened. Me too! <laughs> you I tried my best to listen yes. while I peered through the gap of the classroom door. Oh my god, the stress. Not yet, Nolan, not yet. Not yet. I saw seven boys and girls head down the stairs. Okay, so Ranto's fine. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Okay, alright. Okay. Kaito? Oh, wait. Kaito's fine. Is she talking? Yeah, she is. Rantaro too? continue to walk down the stairs. Oh, God. That's terrifying. I would be like, what the frick? This music, man. Uh, what's a big group like that planning to do? Rantaro was with them, too. Didn't he say he would end this game? Hmm. It's almost nighttime, right? If they're all heading to the basement right now. Come on. Oh. Hey. Could the mastermind be with them? This just happened too? a couple cents seconds ago. Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Angie, Himiko, and Rantaro. Look at her like legs. They're so freaking buff, man. <laughs> One of them is the mastermind. No. Tenko. It is unusual for such a group t to go all t to the basement. No. They're not planning to go into the library, are they? That would be bad. So, okay, so Tenko's fine, Retro's fine. Okay. Last Ryan from the bookcase would ruin the plan. What? I'm going to check out the basement. I'll come with no. you. No, you stay and keep watch, Kaede. With that, Shuichi dashed out of the classroom. Huh? Why am I all alone now? Oh wait, Angie's still alive. Gosh dang it. Realizing <laughs> I was alone, all the fear and anxiety I was trying to hide rushed back in the Ah, jeez! Ah, oh, jeez! I, could, I couldn't keep still, so I grabbed the broom from the corner of the classroom. I started cleaning for no reason at all. I had to move my body. The anxiety was getting to me. Shuichi, please come back already. I continued to distract myself with cleaning until Shuichi finally came. That's something Kurumi would do. Oh god. Hmm. Kaede, what are you huh? why are you sweeping? Uh no reason. Anyway, what about the people down in the basement? Okay. Everything is okay. They all went to the game room. The game room? Why there? To play games, of course. Oh 
I'm sure the mastermind will make their own move soon. If Monokuma is going to show up, then run, time runs out. The mastermind will go to the library. I can't hear myself talk. It happened so suddenly. Wait. Ah. My heart nearly leapt out of my chest as the receiver and Shuichi's hand suddenly went off. Shuichi! The receiver! Oh, God. Someone moved the bookcase. Hurry, Kaede. Shuichi sprinted out of the classroom oh. with the determination of a true ultimate detective. Wait, wait for me. Just wait for me. I dropped everything I was holding and ran after Shuichi. I could feel my heart beating faster and faster. I was so <laughs> nervous, my head felt like it was pounding with every heart. This is this is this is an intense game, man. But like, oh my god, this is crazier than the other. Okay, let's go inside. Yeah. Stop it. Racing myself to confront the mastermind. Who could it be? My hands into fists without realizing. Who could it be? Who could it be? It'll be fine. Everything will work out. It could be anyone. I was still convincing myself when I had caught up to with Shuichi, who had his hand to the door. Who is it? Huh? What are you guys doing here? Oh, sorry. Got it. Well, never mind. Your timing is perfect. You should join our strategy meeting. Right. Kaede is definitely welcome to join. Huh? Strategy yeah. meeting? When the time limit hits, we're gonna fight Monokuma. We got a plan for that battle. We thought it'd be harder for Monokuma to get to the basement, so we're going for the game room. Hey. H hold on! Both of you, come with us! The Mastermind is in the library! Uh, mastermind? We'll explain later, but right now, we need you to come with us. We might really be able to end this killing game. Uh, are you serious? I, I don't really understand, but you just need me to Aikido throw whoever's inside, right? No, I'll do it! I'll be the one to take him oh, down! Geez. This isn't a competition! I'm gonna open the door right now, okay? Oh. With the unveiling, with the mastermind so close at hand, oh, no. all my anxiety had disappeared. I stepped inside the library. No! <laughs> As I walked in, I noticed the moving bookcase at the end of the room was closing slowly. But there was no sign of the mastermind. The moving bookcase had closed on its own, without any outside help. Uh-oh. Where's the mastermind? We quickly walked towards the moving bookcase. And then... Not too far from the moving bookcase. We saw. Get ready, Nolan. Get ready. No. 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 Who is it? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Bingo. That's Wait, impossible! Sorry, That's impossible! <laughs> he wasn't supposed to die yet! You know, I thought the same exact thing too, Nolan. This is my exact thoughts. <laughs> Could you stop? I'm not <laughs> crossing mine out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. So, Rantaro gone. I'm not crossing mine out. Cross him off. Shut up! Do Come it on. now. Shut up! I'll do it! You entered the competition. Where's the pen? Rantaro's dead, Nolan. Where's the pen? Just, just take this one. Okay, yeah. You, there, you Where's find, the... You'll find yours later. Here, Nolan. Here. Okay. I have to use my pen. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Rantaro's dead. <laughs> How is that possible? I, I, I don't know, Nolan. How is it possible? <laughs> it was just like when Biakua, Biakua died. <laughs> but this is different. Rantaro but he was alive. He was, a, he was, who was he? We didn't know who, we don't know who he is. Rantaro Amami. Who no, no, no. To reveal his Are we going to stop right here? 
Yeah. Okay. Bye. Wait. Stop. <laughs> Guys. Da, 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 stop. Da, 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 Shut da, up. Da, da, I need da, da. a sentimental moment right now, please. Thank you. <sighs> How the hell do you make a game where you don't know you you don't know anything like anything about this guy about a person and then you kill them off without any i okay luckily i got a free time event with him at least but that's just not that's just not good enough he is rantaro he's my fa he was my favorite character he is he's w at least one of my favorites i guess but he this is stupid Dead. This is stupid. Gone. What the hell? Gone. He's fading into the light. He's gone. Dead. Disappeared. I thought he would like. I don't know. Forget it. I I don't have anything to say. I need to cope. I need to cope with this. Okay, you guys might be freaking out too. So I don't know. Uh, anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, oh God, this sucks. Damn. Now I feel bad for asking when the next death was. <laughs> Damn it. There's one of that's my why characters. why you never ask gone. that. Now I don't get to speak again. Leoma no one... was supposed to die. Whoever killed Rantaro. Oh <laughs> my god. No. No. Okay. Hey, right, that's going to be it for this episode. I need to cope with my emotions. Hope you liked the video. Comment down below. Leave a like, subscribe. We'll see you in the next adventure of Nolan's Arc. Bye. Bye. Rantaro's gone by too, but bye. Dang, 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 dang.